Hello everyone. In this module, you will be learning how you can apply iteration or loop in lightning component. So jumping onto developer console. So in this module, I will be demonstrating two examples. In one, I will be using string as a list and I will be iterating that through aura iteration. And second, I will be fetching some data from the S object and then I will be iterating on that list. So let's see first example. So creating one attribute, naming it as games, its type will be string array and its default value will be like cricket, football, tennis. So this way I created list of string name is games. Now, if I want to display these values on UI, like cricket, football, or tennis, so I need to apply iteration. So I'm using tag, which will display list of games. And then I'm using aura column iteration. So here you need to use items as attribute and then you can provide v dot games where all the values are available and then uh, to iterate on that list we need to use variable where one by one values will be available so here i am writing it as game now inside this i am implementing an ordered list and inside this list item and here I'm writing game. So whatever values are available in this games attribute, they will be available in game variable one by one. This game variable is part of our iteration and through this line, each game will be displayed in different lines. So I am saving this. This is demo application where I'm using this demo component clicking on preview. So here you will see list of games is available and one by one each game is, games is listed. So this way, if you want to apply iteration on collection, so you can do. Now let's see another example where we will be fetching some data from the S object and then I will apply or iteration. So closing these, going to create new lightning component, naming it as display accounts. And uh, I need to create controller as well, right? And one Apex class will be required. So I'm naming it as account controller. So, Okay, it is already available. So let me just open it. Yeah, here it is already implemented. So I implemented it for uh, another example. So what uh, we are doing here, we are getting the accounts, right? So it is returning ID name uh, from account and limit is five. So five accounts will be fast and they will be available in this ACC list and we are going to return this ACC list, right? So now we need to use this account controller in the lightning component so that we can have this value in the lightning component and we can iterate over this. So here I need to put controller name, account controller. So whenever you want to link your Apex controller with the lightning uh, component, so you need to use this attribute. So first of all, I'm creating one attribute. Naming it as ACC list and type will be account. Right now I'm going to create one handler, its name will be in it. 
value this and action equals to c dot doing it so whenever this component will be loaded this aura handler will be executed automatically and it will be calling this do in it method that we will be implementing in this uh, components controller right so uh, through this do in it we will be fetching the data uh, through this apex uh, controller and the data will be available in this acc list now i am going to iterate this acc list so that results can be displayed on ui so or our iteration items equals to v dot acc list so whenever we use any attribute uh, in the uh, in the view of this component so we need to use v dot and uh, here i need to create variable so naming it as acc now inside this i can display the account value so before that i am writing list of accounts now here account name so kcc dot name so as this is account list and it will be having information related to fields as well so from here we need to return those so name is returned right so we can display that here so name then colon and then account name right this way information will be rendered on the ui if you want to display any other information for example phone type uh, anything else so you can display those as well like this right so what you need to do you need to query phone field as well so whatever field you are using there so you need to query them from here as well right so what you can do first you can create this uh, apex controller uh, which is having one method and uh, you need to use this annotation that is aura enabled right so this i also uh, explained in my previous module like how to call apex controller through lightning component now this part is complete right so this Uh, acc list is iterated and one by one each account will be available in this acc and through this acc we are fetching name and phone of particular account record so i am saving this now i am going to implement this do in it method so replacing it now simply we need to call this apex controller method in this javascript controller so that the acc list attribute that we iterated here Uh, will be having some values right so let's implement this so i am creating a variable naming it as action then component dot get c dot from here i am copying this pasting it here placing a semicolon now action dot set call back this comma function response now here i'm writing component dot set v dot acc list response dot get return value so this is closed i need to use one bracket no it is available here only okay so you need to remove that curly brace uh, sorry round bracket then uh, curly brace should be there and uh, that uh, round bracket will be closed here then you need to place semicolon then dollar a dot and q action and action right so this way this javascript controller is completely implemented so this through this line 
uh, apex method will be called and through this set callback uh, whatever values will be returned through this method they will be uh, set into this acc list that we are iterating over here and uh, through this dollar uh, a dot nq action this action that we set here will be executed right so everything is set now we need to use this lightning component into demo application so display accounts clicking on preview so here you can see five accounts are displayed but they are in same line so if you want to display them in separate lines you need to use br so here i am using br slash here i am using br slash twice and if you want to have horizontal rule after each account record so you can apply this hr tag as well now doing a refresh so here you can see list of accounts so first account name phone number second account name phone number and so on so this way you can fetch data from apex controller through this method and you need to call that method in this javascript controller and here in the ui uh, like in the view of uh, this component you can iterate using aura uh, colon iteration on that account list so this is all about how you can apply iteration or loop in lightning aura component thank you